Hello everyone, I wanted to give you some tips on the rollers that I've learned in the meantime. Uh, I've gone from not combing out my hair thoroughly when I uh, roll it up. It seems to be, you know, less breakage. And then also on the rolling on these top ones, I'm using clips mainly instead of the cap covers. Um, instead of using these, I'm using clips like these. And then the front one I learned, I want to roll back this way because if I roll it forward, I'm going to have a kink at the back and that looks odd. So I want them all going back this way. So, okay, on with the show. Well, here's the finished product. Might look kind of funny in the back, but there we go. There we go. So when I began my rolling of my hair, I opted not to thoroughly comb out my hair because when you roll each individual strand, you have to comb it out anyway so it's smooth on the roller. And on the top, like what I told you, is I roll them back all this way. These roll down. So, yeah, I just wanted to clarify that. I, my hair is not all that tangled. If it were, I would smooth it a little bit more, but, you know, constantly combing and brushing, it's gonna get messed up anyway. So I just opt to comb it out as I do each one. And each roller, you know, I comb from the bottom. I, I don't wanna break it off at the root when I'm coming out, I'm gentle with my hair. Just wanted to, <laughs> I hope that makes sense. I don't know. Okay, time for the big reveal. We're gonna take the rollers out and see how it turned out. Exciting. Well, once again, I'm really pleased. I like the root lift. This is what I like about this, is it lifts the hair up and off the roots. So it gives you a fullness. And then it just ever so slight combing through. I'm not gonna heavily comb it or anything. And then maybe use hairspray wherever I might wanna have it stay. Like I like to have this go back here, right in here. And see, just very little fluffing like it. Thanks so much for watching. See you again soon. Good luck to everyone. Bye-bye for now.